So today's episode is about empowering you to discern when you're meant to let go and when you're meant to hold steady, when you're meant to stay the course. There's times where you may be guided to push through because the only way to move through that particular layer of fear or that particular resistance is to push through it. But that requires divine discernment because what is guided for one person may not be guided for another. You may have 10 people standing and facing one direction and five of them are meant to let go, three of them are meant to hold steady and two of them are meant to push forward. It's not about one recipe fitting all. It's about tuning into what is your internal recipe? What is your guidance system? What is your internal GPS leading you to do in each moment? So it's moment to moment guidance. And in that moment to moment guidance, sometimes we can be totally redirected. We're moving towards something. And if we get attached to moving toward that goal or that intention or that vision, if we get attached, then instantly we're aligning with the ego. The ego loves attachment. Remember the ego is our teacher of fear and spirit is our teacher of love. The inner spirit, our guide, speaks through our heart. It's our internal GPS, our internal guide. And that guidance is actually the divine leading us, leading us individually and serving collectively. So when you set the intention to lead with your heart, to let the divine lead the way, to live life by divine, you are choosing to allow the divine to lead your life and serve everyone 